in Caraga region on Tuesday to see firsthand the damage caused by the tropical storm, a palace official said. Cabinet Secretary Carlo Nograles said Duterte will visit Caraga accompanied by some cabinet members to issue directives on what has to be done to respond to the needs of the residents there. As of yesterday, it was reported that 29,008 families or 112,734 individuals have been affected by the, by the typhoon. Thankfully, we do not have any casualties as of the moment. A total of 18,996 families or 69,682 individuals have been evacuated and financial assistance has been extended to all those affected especially to our fellow Mindanaoans in Surigao del Sur. Rest assured, government continues to closely monitor the situation and preparedness and response measures are already in place. Ngayong araw, nakatakdang bisitahin ni Pangulong Duterte ang mga nasalantang lugar para makita firsthand ang damage na dulot ng bagyong ito. He also assured that local government units and concerned agencies have been responding to the situation in the region. Nograles also hailed ongoing relief, rescue and response operations being conducted in affected areas. Reports show that Tandag River in Surigao del Sur swelled amid the onslaught of Aurin, which caused flooding in parts of the province. The floodwaters were at least knee-deep in the communities with higher elevation. As of Monday, around 112,734 individuals have been affected by a ring with zero quad casualties. A total of 69,682 individuals have been evacuated. Financial assistance has been extended to all those affected.